Okay, should be able to be like a coach. <laughs> yeah, no, I thought it was it was pretty good. You know, I thought uh, I loved this offensively. I thought ball movement was good, sharp, quick, quick decisions, high percentage shots, guys sharing the ball, got to the free throw line. Uh, you know, and then I thought the, the defense overall was very good. Uh, rebounding. As you said, like the, the turnovers also led to their fast break points. So that's you know something you got to clean up. Tom, can you talk about DJ and what he continues to do for you guys since you uh, uh, great, great. You know, they, they, they just uh, just the way he plays, you know, and uh, he plays with a lot of poise, you know, and uh, there's a good pace to him. Uh, he knows how to read things really well. He's reading how screens are being uh, guys coming off screens are being defended. Uh, his ability to pass on time and on target, you know, he, got, he has guys in rhythm, which I think is important. Uh, I thought Joe was terrific. Taj, I thought Carlos got going early in the game, so he played good activity. And then I thought I, I loved the way Tony played. I thought he enforced everything. He, he shot when he was open, he passed when he was guarded, uh, competed defensively. Uh, that, that probably was his best game as well. Tom, I know you, you scored in the 90s on that road trip, but you know, from being in the 70s uh, not long ago, how, how did you guys get the offense back into shape? Well, you know, the, the hard thing was, you know, like I think we were in a stretch of seven and ten days along with the changing lineup. So trying to get uh, DJ up to speed, you know, like we didn't have good rhythm. You know, but each day you can see it getting better, and it's hard to do when you're not practicing, when you're in a ballroom and stuff like that. But that's sometimes that, you know those are your circumstances, and that's what you got to deal with, and you got to find a way to get it done. I just like that I saw. I, I didn't think there was any quit in these guys. Like I thought, uh, the Houston game, we had that one bad stretch at the end of the third quarter. But I thought we played well. And then uh, the Oklahoma City game, the same thing. Fourth quarter, we're right there. You know, so. Uh, you know, and as we get bodies back, uh, DJ gets comfortable. Uh, like I said, I've said all along, I have a great belief in this team. Great belief in this team. You seem to have a lot of success, not only against the Cavs, but against Kyrie. Is it just kind of coincidence or something you guys do defensively that kind of messes with this game? Hey, hey this guy's a great player, you know. So, uh, you know, he, he's, he's playing unbelievable right now. Missed some shots tonight that he that he normally makes. You know, like the, the only thing you're trying to do against players like that is you try to make them work for their points. And so, um, you know, but I, I watch. I was had a chance to be around him with Team USA. And he's phenomenal. Every time he has the ball, there, you know, there's so much pressure on the defense because of his ability to shoot, break it down, and make plays. You know, so uh, you know that's that's about it. You know, I you know you, you look at it. And, uh, you know, they're tough. The you know, bottom's a load. I thought, you know, Joe battled all night. That's, you know, that's a tough matchup. And, uh, you know, where we not only asked Joe to guard his own man, but to also help uh, on others. And he's everywhere. And then when he goes, we got to make sure we're helping him. Uh, so, uh, you know, but overall, I, I, mean, I thought the defense was solid. Do you find that the poise that, that Tony plays with and the pace that well, I didn't like the way he was playing. I mean, we, we talked about it. But, you know, I liked when he first got into rotation. I thought he, he was taking good shots. And he was shooting a very high percentage. And then I thought he, he started forcing a little bit. And that's why I said, like tonight, I thought he played like he had been playing when he first got into uh, rotation. And that, that's really uh, the way he plays. And I think it's one of his great strengths. I think um, very few guys come into the league and have a really good understanding of when to shoot and when to pass. And the game tells you, you can't predetermine, oh, I'm going to be more aggressive when I'm going to shoot every time I touch it. When you do that, you're going to shoot a low percentage. But when you take the right shots, you're going to, you'll, you'll be in rhythm and you're going to shoot a high percentage. So I thought he, tonight was his best game because he got back to doing what he does well.